I recently watched the HBO documentary Andre the Giant and I enjoyed it but I couldn't help but feeling sad by the end of it. For those of you who don't know, Andre the Giant was a professional wrestler. I know him mostly from The Princess Bride. I'm not a huge fan of wrestling so that's how I know him. He was standing at 7 feet 4 inches tall and weighing 520 pounds. Andre was one of the most famous and beloved wrestlers of all time but behind the scenes Andre was struggling with chronic pain and loneliness and due to his size became something of a pop culture icon in the 1970s. 70s and 80s and this film does a great job of exploring his life and career but it also paints this sad picture of him who was essentially imprisoned in his own body and definitely doesn't glamorize his life. Even though he had a very intense wrestling career you don't need to be a wrestling fan to enjoy this film. It definitely goes over his wrestling career and is filled with never before seen footage and interviews from some of the biggest names in wrestling. He's easily twice the size of any other man in the ring and he has a presence that's simply undeniable. However as the film goes on it becomes increasingly clear that Andre is not happy. He talks about how much he misses his family and how difficult it is for him to travel because of his size. He also struggles with alcohol abuse and ways to cope with the pain of his many injuries. While Andre was beloved by fans all over the world, the film shines a light on some of the darker moments in his life as well. His alcoholism was well known within the wrestling community and it often led to erratic behavior both in and out of the ring. The documentary uses a mix of archival footage and present day interviews to paint Andre both in and out of the ring. The interviews are particularly moving. You can see the pain in the wrestler's eyes as they talk about their memories of Andre. He was clearly so loved and everybody who met him, you know, had fond memories of him. They interview, you know, Hulk Hogan, Ric Flair, Vince McMahon Sr. and Vince McMahon Jr. and they all have stories to share about Andre both in and out of the ring and they offer unique insights into what made him such a special performer. They also talk about his personal life. He had a daughter as well and one of the most interesting aspects of this film is it focuses on Andre's health problems. Towards the end of his life Andre was in constant pain due to his giantism and had taken medication just to be able to sleep at night. He was also struggling with alcohol which only made his pain worse. It's amazing he was able to keep going as long as he did considering how much pain he was in. I think in one section they mention his mom had made a special chair for him and it was the only chair that he could actually comfortably sit in and uh, things you would never think about how complicated it was for him to go through daily life. Near the end of the film they interview Hulk Hogan who talks about Andre's health deteriorating rapidly as the months leading up to his death. Hogan describes how difficult it was to see his friend suffer so much and how he wishes he could have done more to help him and it's really just a powerful moment and really drives home how much Andre meant to the people who knew him. And for him to just get in a car wasn't easy. For him to get in a plane wasn't easy. All of these things were his daily life. The saddest thing about Andre is he knew he wouldn't live long. Because of his size, his heart was under constant strain and he knows that one day it'll just give out on him. He still tries to stay very positive and enjoy his time, but it's clearly hard for him. After he slowly passes away in his 40s, it's tragic to think about what could have been if Andre hadn't been so big. I think at one point they talk about surgery or he has some surgeries. He was an incredible wrestler and had such charisma that could have gone to an even more successful career in Hollywood. Instead he was limited by his size and spent so much of his life in pain and I would definitely recommend this film to anyone who's interested in professional wrestling or Andre the Giant story but be warned it is quite heartbreaking. It's an excellent documentary that tells the story of a true legend in an intimate and heartbreaking way so if you're a fan of wrestling or just simply learning more about Andre's life I would highly recommend checking it out. I know even on The Princess Bride he was struggling and there's this scene where Robin Wright's character flies out of a window but they had to have her you know gently fall into his arms. It couldn't actually happen because he couldn't hold her up like that. His, he was in so much pain and he was struggling and it's just things that we wouldn't think about he struggled with every day. It's sad to see such a charismatic and talented man be limited by his own body and ultimately have his life cut short because of it. So let me know have you seen this documentary? What do you think about it?